All right, Shalom, Shalom. Before I get started, I'm going to give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahushai, Bahashem, Rakaha Kodash. All right, double honors to our apostles, as great millstone, Shalom, Wakasa, Lahabakyar, which is peace and mercy to the lake, throughout the four corners, wherever you may be. I'm the brother of Mar from the branch of GMS Cleveland. Come back at you another video. Lord willing to be edifying. Um, <sighs> oh, Salakia. Oh, man, Salakia for that. Um, but yeah, as you can see on the screen, man, this is from, uh, it says the sun, it says the U S sun. Um, I guess that's the name of the, um, the article or, uh, the source. Uh, anyway, the title reads, it says pure evil, Miss Switzerland finalist husband decapitated her before putting body parts in blender while watching YouTube videos. All right. Now. The end of that part, too, it says while watching YouTube videos, that is all, uh, I believe, personally, to censor or put more uh, censorship on the Internet and the so-called um, freedom of speech. You know what I'm saying? Because um, they do want to do away with the Internet and, and uh, put more of a, uh, a leash on those who uh, speak against the agenda. But anyway, that's just me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but going back to the topic, it says pure evil. Miss Switzerland finalist uh, um, husband decapitated her. It says before putting body parts in blender. Right now, this is the spirit of the Lord that moved on this individual to do this. Because you would ask yourself, like, damn, who the hell would do this um, to anybody, let alone your wife? You know what I'm saying? Your lover. You know what I'm saying? Like the one that you, you know, you make love to and share it and have uh, memories with and this, that, and the third. But um, the Heavenly Father put the spirit on this individual to do this. So I'm going to read a little bit of this article and then get some uh, scriptures. It says, a man who, who uh, K-I-L-L-E-D, his wife, it says, was allegedly watching YouTube videos as he decapitated uh, her and put her body parts into a blender court documents reveal and decapitated basically means he uh he severed her head from her body it says former miss switzerland final, uh, finalist christina uh jock simovic all right 38 sounds like russian or ukrainian it says was brutally murdered in february and uh uh Benigen near the swiss town of basile Right, and she's actually not half bad looking. You know what I'm saying? She's a you know, pretty decent looking woman, but men don't care. And you know, men, the Lord's putting that rough, uh, raw spirit on these men. You know what I'm saying? To do away with these uh, wicked women. And apparently, uh, well, I don't say apparently, but I'm guessing. You know what I'm saying? That he did this for you know whatever reason that he saw fit. Because men just don't up and do this out of nowhere. Um, I'm uh, usually when a man does something to this extreme like doing away with his spouse is usually because the adultery was a uh, um a found you know what i'm saying the man found this woman was committing adultery and this is what causes this anger and this type of rage and you know what i'm saying just you know uh so-called rash behavior uh but anyway it says the model husband only named as thomas and local media admitted to strangling his wife to uh, death. It says an autopsy found that Christina, her husband, was used a jigsaw knife and garden shears to dismember the body, leaving her decapitated. Damn. It says her body parts were then uh, a pureed, a parade. When you look that word up, it's going to say uh, basically to like make like a thick. Let me see if it pulls up to make like a thick. Um, um let's see, let me just really put it up. It says uh it says uh a puree or puree is a smooth cr uh, crushed or blended food that has the consistency of a creamy paste or liquid. Um let's see. It says a, a puree or puree is a very smooth crushed or blended food. Uh it was another one that, that pretty much went into it. Um but when you go into it it just means like a, a smooth, thick texture. Or uh, to make something like in a uh, liquid form. That's what it means. You know what I'm saying? When you puree something or puree something, it means like you make like a thick paste or to make like a, um, to make it into like a liquid uh, form. It says, uh, what is considered pureed or pureed? It says, what are pureed foods? It says, 
is a way to change the texture of solid food so that it is smooth with no lumps and has a texture like pudding. So he made like a thick paste, you know what I'm saying? Um, he damn, he grinded her up into like a thick paste, you know what I'm saying? So it said her body parts were, uh, were then pureed or pureed in a hand blender and were dissolved in a chemical solution. Damn, you know what I'm saying? Man, bro, it is crazy, bro. So yeah, let me get these scriptures, man. Um, bro, shit, man. Uh, this is uh. Psalm 68 and 19, I'll start it at 19, the point is in 20. It says, Blessed be the Lord who loadeth, loadeth daily uh, us with, it says, uh, uh, with benefits, even the power uh, of our salvation, Salah. You know what I'm saying? Because the Lord does load us daily with benefits, even um, uh, uh, like something that, that we're considered blessed and beneficial uh, uh, of Yahweh Shemion Shah is not partaking in deaths like this or you know what I'm saying? Or not having a loved one or somebody you really uh, care for have a, a partake in a, a, a death or murder like this. This is crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? So consider yourself blessed. Consider yourself, you know, so-called lucky. You know what I'm saying? That Yahweh Shah has uh, had mercy on you that, you know, you don't partake in none of this. It says, verse 20, it says, And this ultimately, too, is what we're uh, praying to Yahweh Shah to keep us from, which is deaths like this and other things crazy ass situation that we're placed in in the near future that's why we're doing this work that's why we're putting up videos so we so we don't get caught up in these situations and I, that's crazy man that that actually happens bro let me see let me go back i guess you know the shit just starts playing music randomly uh it says song 68 and 20 it says uh he that is our power is a god of salvation and i see how will the Lord belong at the issues of death, man. So, yeah, until Yahweh Bashim Yahshah belong to the issues of death. The reason why that woman uh got blended literally, you know what I'm saying? No, you know, no, it's, it ain't no uh, no metaphor or analogy or nothing like that. That woman literally got, literally got blended to death, man. You know what I'm saying? So, the reason why that happened was because, hey, Yahweh Bashim Yahshah put the spirit on, um, on that man to do so, man. You know what I'm saying? And and you people are gonna find out that the Lord ain't he ain't this, you know, this individual or this entity that you think he want that 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 you think he is. The Lord is a very um merciful and kind and you know um pleasant, you know, God, but at the same time he also has a side to where he's very vengeful. He's very um you know uh so so called extreme, you know what I'm saying? Um uh, you know, and he's very, um, you know, it's like you can get to a point where it seems gruesome. You know what I'm saying? The Lord ain't nothing to play with. That's what I'm saying. When you read the scriptures, you read about the things that the Lord has done and the things that he has put the spirit upon people to do. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, this is uh, Proverbs 19 and 20, uh, 29. It says, judgments are prepared for scorners and stripes for the backs of fools, man. So, yeah, these judgments that are prepared for scorners and stripes, and strife uh, of the of the for the backs of fools. That's because the Lord has deemed these things uh to happen. You know what I'm saying? You can't deny what what takes place here on earth, even though you don't want them to happen. But yeah, it still happens. That situation that took place with the the death of that man. I mean, the death of that 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 woman, which was his hut, which which was his wife, that happened because the Lord wanted it to happen. So you know what I'm saying? We can't uh um um. You know, we, we can't deny it. You know what I'm saying? If anything, we just pray that Yahweh Bashim El Shai uh, does not give us over into the spirit. Let me see. Um, what is that scripture I wanted, man? We get it all the time, man. I don't know why it's escaping me, man. I can't even really remember it right now, but... uh. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Yep. Uh Thwada Yah Bashim Yah Shah. This is Sirach 39 and 28. It says, uh There be spirits that are created for vengeance, which in their fury lay on sore strokes. In the time of destruction they pour out their fears and appease the wrath of him that made them. Right? So there has there are spirits that are created upon earth uh to do the bidding of Yah Bashim Yah Shah and to appease him, you know what I'm saying, to please him. You know what I'm saying? 
Cause that 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 spirit that that that, that man was in, you know what I'm saying, that was a, a spirit that was created to appease y'all, the wrath of y'all by Shemel Shah. The fact that he murdered his murdered his wife and you know what I'm saying in cold blood, like damn. But at, at the end of the day, man, that was that was that was that was was written. You know what I'm saying? The Lord wanted that to happen. He wanted that to happen. You know what I'm saying? So let me get this last scripture and I'm gonna close it out. And there's gonna be a lot more things like that taking place, man. We just gotta prepare our minds, you know what I'm saying? Proverbs twenty eight and five. It says, evil men understand not judgment, but they that seek the Lord understand all things, man. Yeah, so it says, evil men understand not judgment. So if, you, if you're evil, if you're not right with Yahweh Shemel Shai, you don't get what's, what he, you know, what his will is and what's happening for you. I mean, you're evil, you know what I'm saying? And that means that Yahweh Shemel Shai is not dealing with you. You know what I'm saying? Because the will of the Lord will be done day in, day out. Even if it happens unto us and to brothers, you know what I'm saying, and believers. We just accept it and move on and pray Yahweh about Shema Shah have mercy on us and, and you know doesn't tempt us above that which we're able. It says, but but they that seek the Lord understand all things. So we understand why that happened. We understand why that took place. That was the will of the Lord and he wanted that and he wanted that to happen. And more and furthermore to be uh not to get too deep, that woman was here before on earth. She has previous lives that she lived and her past lives, you know what I'm saying, in previous kingdoms, and she has to pay for the sins that she's done. So that's that's just like I said, that was just one of the examples. So and with that, I praise edifying with that I'm gonna give all praise and glory to Yahweh Bashem Yahshai, Bashem Rakadash, A Shalom.